the stars of Israeli TV series Fauda are joining the Israeli fight back against Hamas. From Rona Lee to Eden Amendi to Leo Raz, the popular actors of TV series have come out and call out the barbarity of Hamas and have asserted that their country will keep fighting until it prevails. Speaking to Times Network, Rona Lee Simon said that she is even ready to pick a gun to fight among Israeli forces and defend her motherland. Listen to it this exclusive conversation with my colleague Pradeep. Right now I'm joined by Ronali Shaman, one of the finest actors. With her talent and performance, she has won billion hearts. But today her heart beats for countrymen, heart beats for all those people who had been held hostage for the last several days by Hamas terror organization. And she had been doing whatever she can to get those hostages back so that they are back with their near and dear one. What all you had been doing to get them back? The first thing that we have been doing is obviously sharing this atrocities with the world and, and getting support from all the leaders of the free world in the help of getting our hostages back. I know it's a very tough time for all of you and it's really very painful to talk about those things again and again. But do you think that you will be able to change heart of organization like Hamas, a terror organization? You'll be able to stir the conscience of this organization who did not spare even women and children? It's a very tough question. I, I, and I will say this with the utmost sorrow that anyone could feel. I think that some people are beyond help because if there is any human being that could have done what these people have done to our babies and to our women, these are not people that will ever be able to hear us or talk to us or have any conversation about anything else but bloodshed. People who had been trying to project these villains like Hamas as victims. So what will be your message to those countries, that ecosystem, that lobby that is working against Israel and interest of humanity? You know, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you a bit about the facts. People who have stolen every bit of sources given by the free world to Gaza and everything that they've built was created to murder other human lives is not people that can say about themselves that they are victims. They will never be able to call themselves victim of the situation that they themselves are doing for years on end. This will never be true. Never. Now the world knows. You've seen the videos. You have seen the videos. The hard, what they've done will be forever remembered and forever be, no one will be able to deny this, no one. How do you see the kind of support you got from India and Indians? From day one, Prime Minister Narendra Modi said, he not only condemned that uh, attack, but he expressed solidarity and message is loud and clear. There's nothing called good terrorism, nothing called bad terrorism. Terrorism is terrorism and we need to counter it together. How do you feel so? I feel grateful. Because I think this is the one thing that countries, that all the world should do to support not only Israel, but mankind. If we're not going to condemn this action that was done, it's like we're losing a part of what makes us human. We love India. So many people, you know, India and Israel have such good relationships for so many years. And it's a... It's a it fills my heart with gratitude to know that you guys are standing by us at this very, very tough moment.